Hey everyone, today I'm doing a video all about my piercings. I don't necessarily have a bunch of piercings, but I do have um, a decent amount, I guess. It depends on what you consider a lot, I think. I post on Instagram and on Twitter, uh, like asking you guys what type of videos you guys would want me to do. And I've got so many requests, it's overwhelming me. But this was requested a good amount of times today, but also previously. And I don't know, I was very intrigued to do this because I do love piercings. And um, I don't know, I just think, I love watching these videos, I don't know why. Oh my gosh, I don't know what to say. Okay, um, basically what I'm going to do is go over every piercing that I've got. Tell you how old I was, that was a weird noise. Tell you how old I was when I got them. Uh, the pain for me personally and my experience with getting the piercings. Let's just go ahead and get started. I feel like the most obvious one is on my face, you know. Okay, so the first piercing that I'm going to talk about is my septum piercing. So anyways, I was 17 when I got it. The pain for me, this was the easiest piercing I've ever gotten. And what they did when, when they um, pierced it, the guy, um, you know, he, clam he cleaned it, he clamped it, and then he just shoved the needle through and then he put the jewelry in and I'm not kidding when he put the needle through I did not feel it at all I was really scared to get this but um a lot of people I feel like thinks it think it hurts so bad but if you pull your nose like this and you feel they just pierce the skin they don't pierce like the cartilage so honestly it does not to me it did not hurt at all okay but I do have a funny story <laughs> it's not really funny I had wanted this piercing for so long and my dad would not take me to get it um he was, he just doesn't really like face piercings, so I'd be like, Dad, like, um, if I get good grades, like, can I get this piercing? If I, you know, wash the dog, can I, can I get this piercing? I don't know. I would just, like, make up random stupid stuff to try to talk him into letting me get it. I went without him knowing. I literally had the mindset that I could hide this from him until I turned 18. So, like I said, I had to, I've had it for six months, so I was gonna have to hide it for about nine months. And basically what you can do... It's just flip it right up and you don't even know you've got it. When I went to go get it, the guy or the piercing place didn't ID me. You have to be 18 in Florida to get a piercing by yourself. Otherwise, you have to have parent permission um, or I guess like a legal guardian. I don't know. So anyways, I didn't. I went by myself and they just didn't ID me and they did it. And I hid it from my dad for probably five months. I mean, four months, maybe three months. I don't really know, to be honest. And then he found out. And his face, when he found out, he was like, oh, are you kidding me? He's like, you got that. He was just so, I hate disappointing my dad. But anyways, um, he doesn't mind now. I think he didn't make me take it out because I am almost 18. And he knew that I would just go get it redone when I did turn 18 because, you know. Okay, next, I'm going to talk about my ear piercings. Um, on both of my ears, I've got my first, second, and third hole pierced in my lobes. I don't wear them, to, like, ever anymore, but I got my first hole when I was, like, six months old, um, my second hole for my 14th birthday, and then I got my third hole when I was, like, 15. I was 15, but, um, anyways, I don't remember how bad the pain was for my first hole because I was so young, but my second and my third hole literally felt the exact same. It just felt like a pinch. And then um, it felt kind of hot afterwards, but other than that, it wasn't a big deal. Then here on my right ear, I've got two Ford Helix piercings. I've just got little hoops in them right now, but I got both of these um, like done at the same time, or well, like one after another on my 17th birthday. So I've had them for almost a year. These took probably five months to completely heal. And the bottom one, they did first. And that one did not hurt. It just felt like pressure um, through my ear. So after he did the, the bottom one, I was like, okay, do the second one. Like, I'm good, you know? He did the second one. I thought I was, oh my gosh. It oh, it was a very sharp pain. The, the top one right here, it was a very sharp pain. Okay, next on my left ear, I've got my tragus pierced. The little um, ball that screws onto the stud fell off. So right now I just have this like stud without a ball on it but anyways I got this pierced for my 15th birthday and I had it for a while and then I took it out for like three months and it closed so I got it re-pierced again like maybe five months ago it's completely healed now the second time definitely hurt more I don't know if it's because it went through scar tissue or what but um, yeah, it definitely hurt more. Okay, then I also have got my Rook. Okay, this has been the hardest piercing to maintain. I had it for about five months 
And this is the most painful cartilage piercing I've ever gotten. On a scale of one to 10, it was definitely probably a nine. No, maybe an 8.5. So my tragus is completely healed. I got this pierced literally the exact same day. And this one is still red, still swollen. There'll be times where like it'll heal and then I'll bump it and it gets back to being like swollen and stuff. Oh gosh. And I've asked many piercers like, um, do you think I should take it out? And they say like it's all personal preference. Personal preference because it's the type of piercing that's in such a weird spot that if you hit it, it's going to keep getting irritated. But I am very tempted to take it out because it, it, it's uncomfortable for me right now. But I just love it, so I don't know. I've also got my belly button pierced. If you guys can see, I got this pierced when I was 14. Oops. For some reason, when they pierced it, like I felt it kind of go up my stomach. Like, like I felt it like... I don't know, just feel like a shock, like, right up to my stomach. I don't know, is that weird? Maybe, I don't really remember, but I'm pretty sure that's what I felt. When I look back on it, it wasn't ba that bad in the moment. I thought it was, like, the worst thing I've ever felt. Okay, so those are all my piercings that are noticeable. I've also got my nipples pierced. Um, this is another one of those funny stories. Um, again, you are supposed to be 18 to get piercing without a parent or a legal guardian. I went by myself. They didn't ID me, but I'm pretty sure they knew I was 17. But... You also have to be 18 to get like a sexual piercing, so I am not supposed to get these even if my parent did go with me. They were the worst piercing. I mean, those on my rook are probably tied for the worst piercings I've ever gotten. It was a different kind of pain though. All my cartilage piercings were like a sharp pain. Um, my nipples felt like fire going through them, like I'm not even joking. And oh gosh, here's a funny story. They did my left one first and it was fine, then they went and did my right one and the guy messed up on them on it on the right one so he had to redo it he didn't charge me full price because he messed up but still it was so bad but yes and just a little disclaimer all the piercings that i've got are for me personally um i don't know i feel like a lot of people will be like either thinking or they'll say like oh you got piercings because they're trendy oh you got piercings to impress people uh, blah blah you know no I'm not gonna get needle shoved through my body for somebody else so every piercing that I that I have I got for myself because I have wanted them either for a really long time I love them um, I don't regret any of my piercings so yeah those are all my piercings and the piercings that I've had I hope you guys enjoyed if you did thumbs up this video if not still thumbs it up um yeah hmm I think we're done okay yeah okay thanks for watching I hope you guys have a great day bye